The entertainment industry is a billion dollar a year industry that continues to see massive growth. Live entertainment events are now fully automated and filled with spectacular lights, effects, and music. But how does a person with a hearing impairment experience these type of events? While they can see what is happening, it can be hard to near impossible to hear what is happening. The American Social Health Association estimates that about 28 million individuals in the United States are hearing impaired. This is approximately 10% of the U.S. population. Attending live events that primarily cater to a hearing audience can be a very different experience for the hearing impaired. Many times, the music at concerts is very loud, which can not only damage hearing aids, but also someone's hearing. Due to this, many deaf people turn off their hearing aids, which can make it even harder to hear the music. This is why so many in the hearing impaired community rely on the amplified vibrations being produced by large speakers around them. In recent years, there have been several products that aim to amplify these vibrations even further. The Subpack is a vibrating backplate that translates audio into vibrations. This device is moderately priced and is readily available. However, the device can be bulky and can lack clarity for certain types of music. The Sound Shirt is a tight-fitting jacket that translates music fed into microphones into vibrations. However, this product is expensive, costing upwards of $24,000, and it also lacks clarity between high and low tones. Another serious issue that both products face is converting unwanted noises into vibrations, muddling the response. The focus of our project is to curb these shortcomings so that we can make the show-going experience more accessible and more enjoyable for the hearing impaired. We are creating a wearable device that will allow its user to truly feel music during performances. The vest will not simply translate audio into vibrations like other products, but will instead be programmed to vibrate in specific ways. Multiple vibrating motors placed throughout the vest will be carefully programmed to vibrate with varying intensities and in specific patterns to give the user a sense of the music being played. With enhanced clarity and careful vibration patterns, we will help the hearing impaired experience music in a whole new way. The vest will feature 30 vibration motors placed on the front and back of a vest. The motors can be run individually or simultaneously. To control the motors, we will be using an Arduino. Arduinos are inexpensive microcontrollers that are relatively easy to program and can also be integrated into existing live event systems. To minimize the amount of inputs used on the Arduino, a PCA9685 board is used. This board allows for the control of up to 992 motors while only using the SDA and SCL pins on the Arduino. The PCA9685 only offers 25 milliamps of output current, which is not enough to drive even one motor. For this reason, an in-channel MOSFET is used to drive each motor. A diode is used to protect the MOSFET from voltage spikes, and a pull-down resistor is used to keep the MOSFET fully off when there is no signal present. A capacitor is placed in parallel with each motor to reduce noise from the motor. An external power supply is used to power the motors. Additionally, we have research options to streamline the coding of the project as we want the vest to be programmable by audio technicians with little to no experience in coding. Our solution to this will be the use of a joystick. The inputs of a joystick will be recorded by the Arduino and will be converted into pulse width modulation values that will be sent to the motors. By doing this, we are minimizing the amount of coding that a technician will have to learn before implementing the vest into a show. While the vest is designed with the intention to be used in concert experiences, its applications can be expanded to include any event that involves time-based programming. 
We hope that our project will help the hearing impaired experience an audio world.